Darren, the boys are back in action on Wednesday afternoon. How much are you looking forward to seeing the young squad go up against the challenge once again? Yeah, really looking forward to it. Um, similar to last year, um, we've, we've seen the same this year, that, that the first game is always probably the toughest because you've the players, a lot of the players haven't experienced um, this level of football. Uh, so I think the last month going down in the Premier League uh, International Cup, against West Ham and then travelling over to Holland to play Feyenoord. The players will take a lot of experience from that and the level they played at. So coming back to it now, we're expecting a big jump in performance. We're expecting um, them to enjoy it more and, and probably enforce themselves more on the game than they did in Holland. So uh, really looking forward to it. All the players are and uh, these are the games you want to be involved in. You obviously touched on it there just in, in terms of Feyenoord and the game down south. How much better experience do you think the squad will have going into this game? Yeah, a lot, and it's only one, one or two games we're talking about, but it gives you a lot. Um, I've talked about it from, from last year, the differences we saw off the back of these games in, in the players, the way they trained, the way they did things off the pitch, it actually brings your whole life kind of a step forward because you realise the level. You've maybe realised your ass, you realise there's, there's a layer and, a, and maybe even two above you even at your own age. So then to actually think about breaking into this first team here at Celtic who are playing in the in the real Champions League, um, I just think it's a little bit, uh, it, it's humbling. And I think the players re uh, react well off that. So we're hoping for the same reaction as we got similar to last year where the players now have, have, are going to step it up a gear. We've already seen that in training. So hopefully that now results in a, a bigger and better performance. At this stage of their development, how important do you think this competition is going up against some of the top European talent? It's it's vital, it's pivotal, it's it's very, very important. Um, so we're very fortunate that we've got a first team that are in the Champions League um, and it, obviously it's great for us as, as supporters of the club to go and watch them, but for our young players it's absolutely vital that they, they sample and taste this level of football for so many different reasons, the reasons I've touched on. Um, and ultimately, as a club, it's the benchmark we want to we want to measure ourselves off of. So we want to know where our players are, maybe our Scottish players and players from other other countries, but where our Scottish players are at in comparison to other other players around at the same age um, around Europe. So these games are pivotal. Um, you've got to you've got to enjoy them. But the best way of enjoying anything is is by competing and hopefully winning but for us um, as coaching staff, myself and Mick, is, is performing. So as I said, after the Feyenoord game, we're expecting a, a big jump forward now come Wednesday.